Okay, so here's problem 67. They give you um, an equation for a parabola, and they're going to basically want you to find a, b, and c. Um, so we have three unknowns. We're going to need three equations uh, to find these three unknowns. So let's hope they gave us enough information. Um, to get three equations. Okay, so, but they do tell us some things. They say that th this parabola passes through the point one, four, which means when y equals four, x equals one. So four equals a times one squared, that's one, plus b times one, which is b, plus c. So they've given us enough information there to get the first equation. Now they're also giving us some slopes at certain values of x. So that means we need to find the derivative of this uh, function. So dy dx equals 2ax plus b. Okay, and they tell us, for example, or for one, the slope, that is dy dx of the tangent line, this is... Um, the tangent line is the line, uh, the slope of the tangent line is also the slope of uh, the derivative or the slope of the function. So 6 equals, and this is at when x equals negative 1. So if you plug in negative 1 here, you're just going to get negative 2a plus b. So now we have a second equation. And... Uh, the third equation, dy dx, also equals, um, well, when, when dy dx equals uh, negative 2, x equals 5. So that would be 2 times 5, so 10a plus b. So, let's see if we can find, ex uh, um, oh, so those are our three, we, now we have three equations and three unknowns. So now we can go backwards and plug in. So, for example, um, we can subtract, there are different ways of doing this, of course, but if we subtract this equation from this equation, we would get 6 minus negative 2, that would be 8 equals uh, negative 2a minus 10a, which is negative 12a. So, aha, a must equal negative 8 twelfths or negative 2 thirds. Okay. And what does b equal? Uh, well, let's find b b equals 6, or uh, 6 equals negative 2 times negative 2 thirds, so that's going to be 4 thirds plus b. Am I right? Let's see. Yeah. 4 thirds plus b equals 6, or in other words, b equals 6 minus Four thirds, and that equals uh, fourteen thirds, because six equals eighteen thirds. Subtract four, you get fourteen thirds. Okay, so we've got uh, a and b. Let's find c. So four equals negative two thirds plus fourteen thirds plus c, or in other words, 4 equals 12 thirds plus c. Ah, c equals 0. So that's easy. So the parabola that they want is y equals a negative 2 thirds x squared plus bx, and b is 14 thirds x, 
and c is zero, so there it is.